Welcome everybody. Welcome to We Play On This Gaming. And today we're playing my garage. But this thing is gonna get an overhaul. I have touched every part. I've painted every part. I have like nine hours into this car. So there's my pile of parts. And I guess the main the main goal today is I wanna get this car done. I have another project eventually coming so i want to get this one done that one still we're going to do that one i got to pull the motor out of that for this so but my main goal right now i want to get this thing on the ground so let's get a wrench got that all right let's start with the easiest stuff so yeah i've painted Anything and everything that I can possibly paint. And hopefully it turns out pretty good. Some stuff I might have to, you know, tune up a little bit, but for the most part. And I see how this is just a black rear end. I've painted everything, so. Alright, there's that. This will go with the axles while they're already here. So I'm hoping this thing looks pretty sick when I'm done with it. I wanted to paint the, the gas tank red, you know, race car stuff. But then I thought about it, I was like, you know what? It's going to be like a street car resto mod painted black and orange so oh no oh, no 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 oh you gotta be kidding me well we're gonna do some body work on this i don't know why it does that it drives me absolutely insane oh that's a bummer um I don't even know where to start now. <laughs> oh, and I don't have a save neither. That's lovely. Just great. Anywho, we're going to get it on the ground. And go from there. Hopefully I didn't ruin a whole lot. I didn't even look at the side of it. I don't know if I ruined that door or not. I don't think it did. I think it's just the rear, rear quarter. Good lord, that sucks. I don't know. Maybe we might take it to Mako and have him do some body work on it. But we'll get her back up to tip-top shape. Let's see. Is he gonna do it again? This up in the air. All right. Let's get the transmission in. Yeah, I was not expecting that to happen, but hey, it's my garage, everything happens. So Okay, I guess we can throw this in. Oh, pile of parts. Yeah, we'll throw the drive shaft in. Nope, can't throw the drive shaft in because I got the rear diff. Okay. That brake line's messing with me. Um, the only thing I haven't, I forgot about was the actual emergency brake cable, but we'll get it. Um, everything's so painted and can't really tell what's what. All right, let's grab this, that, steering box, tie rod end, drag link, fitment arm. Okay, apparently I still gotta paint that. Uh, I even painted the brake pads, so. Okay, let's just spit all this out. Oh, I don't have lower control arms, neither. Ooh, alright, so we're gonna have to make a trip. Uh, 
suspension. Definitely forgot lower control room. So, I mean, I've, I've been painting and painting and painting, so. All right, I'm going to fly over there because it's dark time right now, so you guys will see what I'm doing here. Let me spit that out before I lose it. Okay, so enable that chrome wheel, do black chrome, but not, we'll even do black chrome. There's that lower control arm. I believe that's the bushing. Yes, it is. Okay, so you know it's black. Paint that black. I'll paint that red. Oop, paint that red. And then this, that, okay, that's that nut. Back to that. Red. Fly. Okay, that should be everything. Size the brake cable. He breaks, but. We got some fixing to do on the car. Love Looking forward to that. After I just spent all this time doing this. Come on. There's that. At least I don't have to deal with that annoying backpack. I remember that. I used to get the builds almost all the way done and be like, nope. You car disappears. See, I kind of, I, and the bushings and stuff like that, I think it's pretty cool. This is the right front. Gives it character. Okay. Even these. Oh, you can't even see the bushings. Oh, the bushings are red, I'll tell you that. But hopefully you guys like this car. Um, it will look pretty cool when it's done. I think. Um... Other than a quarter panel, I think it'll look pretty good. Uh, what am I, what am I missing? Oh, that hub. Where is it? There it is. Okay, get that on there. Get the steering and stuff done. Oh, oh, the steering box and stuff. These, I didn't really know exactly what to do with. So... I'm going to look at them and see what I think about them. I didn't want it all black. Because then it just looks stupid, but. Gotta give it something. See, it just, instead of it all being black. High rod ends. Come on. So we have those urethane bushings. Kind of the look I was going for. I thought about painting them orange with the car, but they didn't look great. They didn't turn out the same colors, so I said, nope, we're going red. It just, it doesn't look all gaudy and stuck together. All right, front hubs. I think this is it. That's one of them. Where's the other one? Uh, the other one roll away. Yep. Uh, I went with the 40 millimeter spacers. I think it's going to be enough. I'm not sure. So. There's that. Come on. Get it. Got it. Uh, even the rotors. Um, let's get the backpack out of the way. Um, what is this? Bro. I even darkened these down a little bit. Chromed them out. Made them look dark. Okay. 
I need another front. That's a rear. Throw that in the backpack. That's a rear. Right, there's a front. I'm really curious to see what the engine bay looks like. I think it's going to turn out pretty sick. I hope. I hope that spacing's right. I hope it is. That was a lot of work, but. Okay, so we got that. I guess we could throw the callip. No, I gotta put the brake pads on. Where did I put the brake pads? They're there. Yeah, so when you buy these, the backing's actually chrome color. So. I wanted them to actually look like a brake pad, because when you buy your brake pads, they're actually. The, black, the back of them's black, so. Alright, so that's a front. Front, front, rear, rear, front. Okay. There's the fronts. There's the rears. Alright, where's the rear caliper? That's rear. That's the right rear. Okay, front. Okay. Front. Front and rear. Other side. So I painted all the bolts. I mean, there's nothing I left vanilla, I'll tell you that. I'll show you the brake lines here in a second. Those are actually braided. Okay, there's that. I braided everything. Where did I do it? There, there. Okay. All right. I painted the fittings. Made the lines braided, so it, let's see if I can bring them in. They're actually braided. So, talk about time and effort into this build. I have never built anything like this, so. You gotta at least give me an ad boy or a thumbs up or something for this. I have way too much time into this build. I just hope I don't have to rebuild the whole car from that but hopefully it's just the back panel and the, i hope but that's a bummer okay so we'll grab these should be able to set the car down here in a minute then you'll see the flavor rims that i picked out ah that's looking cool all right anything else oh trash yet oh rear gear Oh, we already put the gear in. Okay. Get the drive shaft in it. Oh, I missed one. Sue me. No, how is that possible? I'm going to blame that on a glitch in the game. There, there's a front. Rear, front. Now these, I didn't really know exactly what I wanted to do with, because, oh, I missed the bolt there. Um, it's so hard to get this thing to work right. Because if you paint the bushings, or you paint anything on it, the bottom half, I painted that one. The bottom half changes color, so, try to, see how the bushing? I wanted them both red, but when she paints the red... It changes that color of the sleeve. But if you have an idea of what color I should go with on bushings, you let me know. Or what color shocks. Does that look cool or does it just look... I want it to stick out. I know I chromed them, but... 
I don't know. I almost thought about doing like some blue or red. I don't know. I gotta look at shocks. Like, wanting to do like a gray, chromish gray. Okay, I do believe. Yeah, I can put the wheels on now. Make sure I got all the brake lines tight before I even do all this. Tight, tight. I am very bad at brake lines. For some reason. Okay. Get her down and. Get her down a little bit. Okay. Now, hopefully, my spacing is correct. It might clear. We're gonna find out. I even painted the valve stem and the actual tire itself too. I didn't like that flat color look, but I like how that that caliper sticks out. And then the rotor's not too. I mean, everything sticks out, even the bushing, shock. That looks cool. I mean, it's not like real noticeable, but. Oh, I missed the bolt. So, I mean, some of this I'll have to go back over and double check and fix this. The back window, and looks like got the trunk and everything. Dang it. All right. Let's see what this thing looks like on the ground. Yeah, I have to go in on the front. But for now, let's see. I made the lift. Only that. Gotta tuck those in a little bit, but. Oh, that's going to bug me. All that work. Oop. I got the inside too, yeah, it did. Hmm. Alright. I don't want to use it, but I'm using it. Nope, wrong one. Do I even have it? Thought I had it. Alright, so... I don't know where the sludge is. I had one. It's fine. Whatever. Okay, uh... Grab a wrench. Whatever I do with my wrench. Not there. There it is. Alright, let's continue on. Uh, I did black out everything in the front. I tried doing these the same color as the car. Didn't match. Um, and then I did the outer ring of the headlight orange. With the blacked out the emblems. Everything is orange. So. And now I can open up the door. Yeah, I always forget that, right? There. Let's get the rat in. Gotta go the all aluminum. Throw the battery in it. Chrome that out. Chrome black. Made it look cool. Okay, wires fossils in. And 
and the hoses. He's he's turned out all right. I don't know. Chrome the clamps and everything. That's the fuel line. I don't think that's gonna turn out very good, but we shall see. Once I think once it stretches, it changes. Doesn't look like this. Okay, what else am I forgetting? Windows. Exhaust, gonna have to wait until afterwards. Fuel line. I wanna keep everything in order, so. Alright, let's work on the interior. Get the window regulators in. Yeah, I even messed with these two. So, these were white. That was kind of gray. I even changed color door handle. Okay, there's that. That. Now we need the windows. That looks like driver's side. And the other driver's side. Yeah, we got the door too. I can tell. I can't see the bolts. Man, it did a number. Me messed up the black trim there. Little drive shaft's poking through. I don't even want to look at it no more. <laughs> it's kind of, I'm kind of disgusted to be honest with you here. Yeah, it was this wiper motor. So if you haven't noticed this container here is actually more of a yeah, let's see more of a clear I actually tinted it okay back windows which are going to come out anyways at least on the right side But I'm installing the car, I gotta put it all together. This is all. <sighs> Anyways, alright, so for interior, let's put the dash in. You guys will like this. So the interior looks like it's used up, but it's not. So I actually took a suede decal. I forgot to paint the bolts black, but. Can't see it when the door shut. So from like 30 foot away, it looks suede, but when you get right up on it, it looks like the actual interior you get out of the junkyard. But well, that's a bolt. All right, so let's do the headliner first. Need the mirror. Headliner stay. This is the back panel. That's the back panel, which all that's going to come back out. I'll bolt it all here in a second. Then I just got to get trying to get everything in the car. Now the only thing I have not done is the visors. I haven't got those yet, so. Game's glitching out. Oh, 
What am I hung up on? Okay. Stuck on the door. I wanted to do the floor in this so it looked like carpet and all whole full suede interior. But the floor is not double, double layered, so it doesn't have two textures to it. So once you paint one texture, that's it. So I wish they'd put a double texture on this and the firewall. What am I? It's got to be that back panel. So, I mean, if you stand back a little bit, it kind of looks like it. You look inside. You know what I'm saying? It kind of looks cool. Uh, the headliner's even done up. But I'm telling you what, look at this dashboard. I do believe, I don't know. I'd have to hook power to it, but I do believe it lights up orange, too. Alright, what is it? There's orange. Got it. Okay, so we got to do, we got to get some wafer arms. Who needs wafers? You just give me the check mark here. I don't know. I, I, if you're not a fan of orange, I, I agree 100%, but that still looks sweet. Okay, so I did not do a steering column. Okay, so we're in the Jesse anyways, um, interior. Some of the stuff is not added in on the jet or the Jason, so. But. That's the wrong one. All right, so we'll go back up here, right there. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, so I need that and white berms. Accessories. Okay, what else? What else do I need? Oh, I can't remember. I don't know. I kind of was thinking leaving that like that, but then I, then I think it kind of looked cool blacked out. All right, let's fly over here. Enable black E object. What is that? Oh, okay. All right, so I'll do this F F zero six nine. Apply that. Bolts. Apply. So I've done this on every part, so. There's that. Okay, so. And these, I'm just going black. Black chrome. There's some more color instead of just like that dull black. Okay, so we even have an orange key. That's cool. Tell you what, man, my OCD is getting to me on that rear quarter panel. Okay, what did I do with the wrench? Buried in the pile parts. Right. Okay, grab my steering wheel. I fought hours and hours and hours trying to get the color right. I had to go chrome because they wouldn't do it any other way. So we got wafer blades. What was I just going to do? I forgot what I was going to do. Oh, pedals.
Victor. So these I'm going to leave alone. Just can't really see them anyways, so. Is it more of that regular feel? I was going to paint them, but. It is what it is. Alright, so wipers are wrench. I gotta put the mirrors on as well. Okay. Now these I did black and I was gonna do like a orange chrome color, but then I thought it looked stupid. So now they're kind of hidden. Can't see them until you need them. All right. Uh, we need an engine. Guess I'll throw these on. Wrong side. Oops. I think I know what's bug what's glitching my game, watch this. So if you ever have this issue or get rid of this back glass. For some reason that texture of that glass really hurts the performance of your game. Okay, now it's fine. Well it's a little glitchy, but Oh, it is what it is. Okay. So let's put the exhaust on. I want I really want to see the exhaust. So we need this motor out. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh, there's a wrench. Plus, I really think it looked very cool in the engine bay. Nope. Why can't I grab it? Just give it here. So that's going to go back in the motor. Took it out. Took it off at the wrong part here. Yeah, right here. I do want to do the turbo on the diesel as well. I thought about beeping it up, but I don't know. Oops. Just don't know yet. Starters over here. Okay, bells and bolts. I can't see anything. Almost at it. What I loosen up? Anything? There it is. Just give me the block. There we go. Okay, drop this colorful thing in here. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Radiator hoses are doing some goofy stuff. There they go. Forgot how much room you actually have. On these Chevelles and El Camino and stuff. The firewall gives you so much room for the bell housing. Yeah, there's that. No, we can do the exhaust. Let's 
it's gonna be a reach and grab here. That's the other side. So I went with the dark stainless look for the exhaust pipes. I did the black tips. So, I think that's pretty much everything so far. Let's see, does it clear? Yes, it does. Cool. Why is my game like. I don't get it. it does not like something on this car. Okay, let's get to it. I don't have an e-brake hooked up. Get open. Real big bummer. Oh. Okay, that's done. Center panel, the rocker panel is probably going to come off. Everything that I just did. Oops. I know I'm dissecting it, but... These parts should come off as, I'll just have to put them back on. Okay, so that door's gonna come off. This is the luxury of doing this stuff, so. If you're new to the game, welcome to it. You'll waste a lot of time doing this, so. If you're looking for something to do, Perfect. All right, so I need a right rear quarter panel. It's yes, quarter panel. Um, need a right bumper. Need a metal lip. Screw panel balance. Right side rocker trunk. Right rear. Right rear. And front right. All right, so grab that. Oh, where's the wrench? Okay, so this panel's gonna come off. Take the mirror off. I knew I should never put everything back on, but you know what? You guys want longer videos? Here you go. <laughs> uh, don't know what else to say. This sucks. By well, half the time, I don't drive these things because one wrong oops, and you done wasted everything. So, I mean, here's a good good overview of the interior. Looks pretty sweet. I hope that frame is not bent. Looks fine. Okay. I know I cut a weld off. Okay. 
Oh, I thought I got a weld. Maybe not. That frame is bent. Urgh. Don't care. Fix that another day. Okay, I think I have everything. I just gotta take everything off the panels and stuff. I am so clustered, like, right, right now I'm just... Words can't describe how frustrated I am. That can go in the junk pile. That can go in the junk pile. This I need the fuel tank out of. So you'll get to see what I normally do. Um, every panel. The trunk I'll paint by hand because I can't put a decal on it. This, I don't know. That license plate might be fine. Okay, so I need... Where's the door? I need to see if I gotta put a rocker panel in this. It's fine to me. Okay, there's that. Well, that door might not be bad, actually. Is it? Or is it the door? I hope it's not the door panel. No, the door, the other door is junk. Okay. Alright, so now I gotta grab... What else do I need? What else do I need? Um, Accessories, I need a right rear trim. Tail lights, and then I need the license plate. Okay, fuel door. Right. Let's grab the truck. Uh, trash bag first. Try to clean some of the stuff up. Whoa! Oh, I need the door. Dang it! I need the door handle off that. Fuel line doesn't work for this car. Sure. It'll fall off. Alright, so I gotta grab this truck. Steering wheel's working just fine. Besides force feedback. Come on. Roll the window down. Gotta get a back window. Oh, I got ten out. That's right. So. I still feel like I'm gonna hit something. Alright, let's start loading. Is it this motor that's doing it? 
One too many, uh... One too many objects on the ground. Here. Whatever. I think I know what it is. I was messing with Feeds' uh, junkyard, scrapyard mod. I went over and I looked at it, but when you... Um, when you despawn the scrapyard, not all the parts disappear, so... But that's mods. End of the story on that. She wouldn't fit in a backpack. You're small enough. So one of my questions with this game is, okay, you have two hands in life, right? Real life. Why can't you use two hands to pick stuff up? Break cable. Where I get all too carried away here. All right, we're in Jason. Uh, Jesse. Breaks. They even have a break. Nope. Okay, I think we're good. So normally I drive over here if I have a ton of stuff, but... It's just a couple items I'll fly over. It takes more time to get in and out of the truck than it does anything, but... Okay, so now you get to watch the process besides the glitching of my game. It's driving crazy too, but... Enable... All right, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna reload the game. See if that fixes it. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. It didn't really help. Um, but so one thing I did find out that the interior did not save. So gotta go back to the drawing board on that. But you'll get the idea of what what all I have to do. Was messing with this stuff, so. Alright, we'll go with 6464. 64. It kind of gives it a little smoke color. And change that to 646464. 64, 64. Enable. Okay. Bumper. Black that out. So now I got to figure out what I want to do with um, interior. So. Okay. 
understand why it's not painting. Okay, I guess I'll have to paint that. Paint that. The door I gotta hit. No, I don't. Oh uh, yeah, the panel and the channel. All right, so that's blacked out. Yep. Um. So that's that. I think that's all I did for that. Um, your sail panel. That I have to. Hey, what about that? Okay, inner panel. He did say, I did talk to Pete, he did say he was gonna eventually make this movable, hopefully, so. Let's chrome it out. Alright, chrome piece. And we will. I think the rest is paintable. Yeah, I grabbed the wrong fender. That's great. Oh, the struggle is real. Jason, body. There we go. Um, I can't leave that alone. I don't know why I did that. Inner panel. Got to change the back. So. Well, come on, just paint the thing already. There we go. Paint the inside. I think that's it. I do believe that's it. Just grab the parts. Shut this before I can't shut it. I like how every time you load the game in, the windows are always rolled up. They definitely got some bugs to work out. And a 
garage door shut. Love it. Oh, wrong door. I don't know what's making my game all glitchy, but run over here and grab the paint gun because I'm going to need it. That's done. Rear quarter panel. Yeah, we're doing some shade tree backwood stuff right now. I'm just, right now I'm kind of irritated. Uh, wasn't supposed to get damaged. Way too much time and invested in this car. That's it. So I got the roof a little bit too. That's fine. Get over your sail panel. Can't go on without the lower valence. I forgot the trunk. We'll get it here in a second. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just floating along here. I'm just I'm disgusted. That's all. Okay. That welder just said ejecto cedo cuz it's out of here.
I mean, it does look pretty good with a white interior. Just anything I put a texture on. Um, the hoses didn't save. So, textures do not... Unless I did it with the chrome, I could be... Pop no, because the seats weren't chrome. That's right. So, I don't know exactly what's going on there. I need that center panel. Bumper. Hmm. Tail lights, lights. Oh, I forgot the wheel well. So I need the rear. I need the trunk floor. Wherever the trunk floor is, show yourself. All right, go back over here. Take it back. That panel's hit too. This whole car is probably tweaked. So we'll just send this off a bridge. I mean, I will say I have, I have drove worse. But I guess from the naked eye, you won't see it, so. Okay, so now I need a screwdriver. Nope. This on. It's the only bad part about doing cars like this. I buy like the same exact side. I did. And so, you know, I'll do that off. Um, I'll do that off the camera here. I'm, I'm done. Oh, so I need left. Left side, tail light. Accessories. So now I gotta figure out what I'm doing on the dashboard. Should I just. All this stuff has to be either chromed, chrome black, or everything's got to be taken out. I really like the look of that interior. 
But if it doesn't save, there's nothing I can do. Guess I can go factory. Decisions. Gotta paint that. Gonna install that. Okay. Ooh, we put this on. There. It's like brand new. Brand new but used. Alright. Um tailgate I don't know and I don't know what, what to do with all this I spent so much time so much time trying to do that interior and make it look right just for it to don't say anyways just another day in my book Break. Can't see nothing. All right, so I got to remember window tint too. This should go fairly quick. If I just chrome black everything, then it should be fine. I like see, got it. Yep. Black. Can have a little glare to it. Cause if I just paint it black black, it's the factory color. And the one thing I forgot was the headliner, but it is what it is. Another day. Uh, I believe it's that. Yep. Okay, this. All right, one more panel. I do the e brake. Draw this in here. So, definitely been a struggle bus. Paint the glove box. Whatever the glove box is. Okay. 
Blood box has to be taken off, so what I'll do. Um... Wanna go out for a drink after my shift? No, I'm good. I do that too late too. I didn't grab till it. Oh, well. okay, screwdriver spit out. Can't get the glow box open. Yes. This one. Yeah, it should be on the bottom. Uh, got it. Come on. Give it. Oh. Did I do it right? Yeah, I did it right. Okay. Just double check to make sure. Okay, so all I have to do is a tail light. Yep, definitely a, a video that hasn't went to plan. Nailed it. Because none of this stuff went to plan. Backseat. Because I still got to get a back window. Open. We're at dashboard. I mean, it's definitely not the same, but it'll work. That I can't put on until I put the window in. These I can put on, though. Really need to hook up the e brake before I run this car into that tire changer. Come on. Okay. Window. Panel. Seat. I don't know if I can put this on or not. Well, I mean, the only people that know it's wrecked is me and everybody that watches it, so... I just gotta fix those front wheels. Right, what else? I gotta get the... Oh, I didn't... I did have it with me, didn't I? No, I didn't. Okay. Alright, now I should hold. Back her up a little bit. Alright, so I need a screwdriver. Alright, 
Okay, so window, rear window. We're gonna wash it. Yeah, I saved these. I was gonna reuse them, forgot all about them, and I thought about it. I was like, I have a window already. Now we just need a back window and that taillight. Right here. Windows! And we should be done, finally. I'm getting tired of sitting in this chair. Tell you what, this video should not have taken this long. But, I'm over here trying to be... All different here. Oop, hold up. Slowed up. Okay, so I don't remember what... What color code I did this. They might be different, but whatever. Uh, the black chrome. And then index. I went enable. Apply. Sure. It's a little darker. Everything's good. That was a little darker. Okay, for tent. What do they got? Three, two. What do I get? Two and three. I'll try to do the dark in the back. We'll do the two in the front. Do the front window. Now the question is, is wheel spacings for the front? That I'm gonna have to do off I'll probably have to end up doing off camera, but Once I get those front wheels figured out, this thing looks pretty sweet. Actually, not liking that tint though. How it changes. See, I have OCC, OCD real bad. So like shop looking dirty like it is, and just can't leave nothing alone. Okay, so that was two. probably go darker but I don't want it you know I want to be able to look up on it and be like oh that looks sweet you know hmm so then uh <laughs> they're actually purple that's funny I don't want to run that motor too much. I don't have any oil in it. I don't think, anyways. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got it. Oh, yeah, it doesn't take uh, oil or anything. So let's fill this thing up. See if I can go wrap this thing around a telephone pole. First, I have no brake fluid. Man, I don't think it hurt it anymore than what I've already heard with that lift. Yeah, this thing doesn't take any fuel or anything, so. 
Uh, if you're listening, you might want to turn the volume down when I start this back up again. You know what? Actually, now I think about it, this is actually the first time I've drove one. Right, one thing I do need to do... Tighten these things down before I f they fly out. I get to them. I hate these things. That one's already tight. Did I already tighten them? That one I did. There we go. Right, let's see what she got. First drive after, I don't know, feels like a couple months. Thing's gonna be screaming. Hold on to her. Ah, she handles like. Something don't feel right. I don't know, it might be the car, but... Yeah, I don't know, something... Something don't feel right. Something feels loose. Could be the tires. See if she got him. Oh, they don't even smoke. That's lovely. I May mean, looks pretty good. Look better with some uh, racing stripes on it, but another day, I guess. Turn. Yeah, stalled it. I don't know. See, it, it's already messing up. I don't. I forget to do here. Yeah, it did the same thing last time, like all the other cars. He breaks off. It's like I'm hitting a wall. get it.
The wheels are turned. Will it turn the other way? Yeah, it turns the other way just fine. Maybe. That's weird. It won't turn left. Turns right just fine, but she won't turn left. Y'all seen it. I don't... the most stressful thing I've ever done in my entire life. Okay, so she's built. Can't really drive it, so. Alright, so I've had some time with the car. I stopped, you know, relaxed, chilled out. I almost rage quit, um, but I did figure out the issues with the car and the reason why it was doing what it was doing. Uh, the back seat was not bolted down. So that's what created the car to do all the goofy stuff and flip over and everything. Problem solved. So, let's finish this off with a bang. I'm going to change this car up a little bit. And we're going to put some parts from Lars. Uh, from his Discord. And we're going to make it look sweet. So, that's the plan. Now, I do have to go to the Jesse. Get the front bumper, and then I'm going to change up the front bumper because it doesn't allow the parts that I'm going to put on to work right. So, okay, so we're going to go race hood, maybe. Come on. All right, let's do this again. Race hood, and then we're going to do the Chevelle L88 scoop. Mask her wing and front spoiler. Okay. So now I'm chilled out, not all raging over here. Let's let's do this right. I be honest with you, I was getting pretty frustrated with this car. I mean I've spent a lot of time. Uh way more time than anybody ever does in their videos, I guarantee it. So Let's get this thing apart. Uh, we do have to paint the bumper and these. Uh, trunk's good. Sure. All right, so we need to go get the paint. The bumper I have to take over to the store. Might just fly over there and do it. I cannot wait until... Wrong one. I can't wait until that pallet, you can move that pallet. Because I'm tell you what, this save a lot of time in building these cars. But when I have to constantly go over there to paint a part, and then I mess up the part, and then I got to go back, it does get frustrating real fast. So, we got to take this hood over there too, because I want to get these chrome, chrome screw-on things. Um... Get those painted up black. I gotta take this over and get the bolts to color match so you can't see them. Fill that there. Make sure that's extra painted. 
Okay, so this, I'll probably end up taking this off 900 times. Because I do want to put some stripes on this car. And a pain in the butt, so. There's that. Yeah, let's get this hood off. Now hopefully this clears. I kind of looked at it. I think it's going to clear. I don't think anything's going to pop through, so. Should be good there. Yep. So I thought. I kind of. Kind of did one like one of these deals here. Yeah, it'll fit. Okay. So. And I, look, I was looking at it. I was like, well, it does. It will work. So. I think it looks cleaner. I do like the, you know, the raised up hood, but I I kind of like this too because it gives it that race car look. Okay, so we can get rid of this. Now, like I said, I do got to take this back off. Um, I got rid of the box. I got tired of taking it in and out, so. All right, let's get this in the back of the truck, get these painted up. I was gonna do a spoiler black, but I think it looks cooler matching the car. Yeah, there's that. Guess I'll sleep in the truck. Now that should be open. Uh oh, hold on. Hold up. I gotta go in here and do. Oh, let's see. What do I do? What do I do? I do? Um. Let's go to Jason. I have to change the front brakes, so this thing needs to stop moving. Okay. So these have to be painted as well. I have to take a rotor off. Oh, I gotta get the hubs too. Dang it. I gotta fix that tire from going into the fender, so. Okay, there's the hubs. Gotta pick up some spacers. I have 40 millimeters on that. But to make these rotors match, I have to take, take it off, so. Okay, let's take this side off. Perfect. That was easy. I know that's got to come off or put it back on. So let's separate these. Okay, we're not. All right, now I can get the paint code for these. Now we should be good, I believe. No, we're not. Dang it. Um, let's see. Let's go to Lars's race car stuff. Race car parts. Accessories. Um, do the gauge two. I think it's RPM too, yeah, it's these two. Yeah, the backpack don't work for those. Um, what else do I want to do? That's steering wheel, that's right. Trying to make one trip over here and be done with it. I'm tired of going back and forth, back and forth. I've done it enough today, I'm tired of doing it. Okay, sneak in here. I'm 
I mean, it looks cool. It's orange, but I think it'll look better a different color. So it's just too much orange for me. Come on. Window work. Okay, tailgate down. Start with the bump. Start with the bumper. And we're just going to straight up black that out. Okay. On with the hood. These, like I said, the only thing I'm blacking out is these little tabs. I think it's this. Yeah, it is. There, that looks better. Matches the theme. These, I have to paint the bolts to match the paint colors. So FF6900 bolt. Nope, I gotta do it again. Dang it. All right. Okay, so that should match now. Steering wheel, thinking just the ring. Oh, yeah, I can live with it. Okay, now the rotor, I gotta figure out the color. I think it's that, so we're gonna control V, which copies it. And come over here, enable, highlight, control, no, control, C. whoops, I did that wrong. Control C and then control V, control C, there we go. All right, control V. There we go. Enable color. Apply. Oh, I forgot the chrome. There we go. Now they match. Back those up. Okay, now for the gauge. Oh, for these hubs. Those are just black, chrome black, I think. Close enough. And then... Something in the store does not like my computer. I've noticed that. All right, for these little guys, let's see. How do we want to do these? I can see it. All right, so this is what? Okay, so it's FF6900. Apply that. So those are needles, okay. Alright, so we're gonna do this, black that out. Black those out. And we'll black that out and then
Sure. Those look alright. I can live with that. Okay, this little guy. Get a little closer. What are you? Alright, so you're the outside of it. Okay, this. I'm not sure what this is. FF690. Okay, that did absolutely nothing. Nothing. Okay, there we go. So then looks good enough for who it's for. Okay, so there's that. Alright, so there's that and that and that. And the stairwell. I think we're good. I guess just we'll just start throwing parts on this thing. There's that. So we can throw the front. Grab the front bumper. Throw that on. Alright. Grab the wrench. I forgot to grab those spacers. Valence on it. See those bolts kind of hide themselves. They're not the same color, but hey, it is what it is. So this, get rid of that. That bumper looks more clean and sleek. It doesn't have the bumper guards on it. I like it. Okay, so we need this, but I have to go get the spacers before I can finish it. Alright, so I need the screwdriver. But I can at least get it somewhat closer, you know. Okay, I guess we'll grab... Do the same thing on the other side. So I can backpack this, I can throw on. Okay. Yeah, there's something in that vicinity of that direction. It's, I don't know. Comes and goes, so.
All right, so I'm going to fly over there real quick, grab these spacers. Did I ever tell you I'm a French immigrant? Right, so I did the... It's hard to believe, huh? I had the 40s on it, so I guess we'll try the 30s. I only need, like, maybe an inch. Black knees up real quick. I did talk with Beads. He's working on trying to get the textures to save. He didn't know it was an issue, so... Hopefully we have our interior back. Okay, so... Just throw that there. Throw these back on. Spacer. Hopefully this will work. And throw that back on. Hopefully it should clear now. Okay. Um. What else do I want to do? That steering wheel taken care of. I got these guys. So this goes right here on the hood. I want to say it's a screwdriver. And then this one goes on the dashboard. It might be too many gauges, but... Okay, there's that, that, and that. Alright. Let's set it down and see what it looks like. I can tell you right now, it might be showing a little bit, but slight, just slightly. I'm, I'm okay with that. To be honest with you, that looks a lot better. I mean, obviously, when you turn the wheel, it'll, it will show, but overall, I don't really care. Okay, so I gotta take the trunk back off. Man, I, I can't stand this glitching though. What is it? This truck sitting in the way? Too many vehicles over here? I don't know. I'm well aware of the glitch. Might have to get rid of a truck. I don't know. Try that again. It's still glitching. I mean, I don't mind frames for second drop, but that constant glitch drives me absolutely insane. Okay, so we'll leave that loose because I have to take that off and on a million times. Okay. Hopefully I have enough decals. Let's see how these look. So C flattens it out. 
X raises it up. Oh, shoot. Alright, so... <sighs> make this work. So I'm going to have to buy this hood again. Alright, so... Let me buy the hood. So, with this... Master Painter deal, I can't remember the name of it. What is it called? Looking it up right now. Material master. There we go. Spit it out. Um, you have to paint whatever you're going to paint. Has like all the details and stuff have to be put on it. And then you can paint the hood. So I'll show you what I'm talking about here in a minute. So, race hood. And then 88. Screwdriver. Okay, so I'll show you here real quick. This little trial tester. Show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so you have two hoods that are the same color. The only difference is, is I put the black... Uh, body screw things. I can't think of the name of that, but Okay, so these are black these are not Now the decal shows decal does not So um, To make it work you have to put the decals on first and then you can paint the rest so Well, those aren't going to work. Let's try these. These are so bugged out on mine. But it is what it is. It's a 30 footer. So. Okay. Alt. Then you can move however you want. Nope. I mean, it's not going to be perfect, but it should look okay. Let's see. Like I said, I mean, you stand back. It looks pretty decent. Okay, so this. Those are definitely too wide. Looks okay. Throw this on. But you just get on there. I can't pick it up. There. This is so hard to do. Let's see, can I alt it? Close. Gotta go back some. What do I gotta do? Too big. I'm 
big enough. Yeah, it's so hard to do. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll take it off. Hopefully I'll mirror through. I don't know. Okay, if you ever have an issue of trying to paint something, put it on something bigger. Okay, so these... Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Oh, now it wants to work. So I'm going to try to get this as close as possible, but it might be off. But it might look good from far away. I'm not sure. Um, apparently I missed that just a tad bit. Looks good enough for my house. Um, grab this, throw this on. Decals are so hard in this game, it's it's unreal. So, all right, so that's looking better. Now I got to get a screwdriver. Uh, you let me know if it leave this on or take this off. I mean, to make it look clean, I would take it off. But trying to give Lars some credit. I mean, that man's been working his tail off on these mods. So, okay. So now I'll take this over here. Leave us that. Yep. Black those out. Like I said, it's not perfect, but you know, you sit in the back 40, you know, when you park your car out way out back, you walk out the door, it looks great from far away. So, okay, so the next thing I want to do is just tint. I don't like how the back window's darker than the sides. So I'm going to paint them. They're, I'm going to do them the same color. So I think it was three. There, that's better. I always like to leave the front windshield clear so it's not so hard to see in the dark. The side windows, you know, you could just roll them down, so. There's that. Clean up a little bit. Child there. And there. It's a sweet looking ride. So, I mean, if you look closely, 
Okay, I had it. This headlight has a chrome ring around it from factory, and I orange I put made it orange. So when you kind of look at it, it kind of gives it like orange halos. Which this side is off. So never noticed that before, but so now I'll show you. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna save it. Just in case the rap sing around a telephone pole, I don't I'm not gonna cry. I'm telling you. This is by far the most time that I have in one of these cars. Man, this thing looks like a spaceship in here with all these gauges. Okay, where's the e brake? There we go. Uh headphone users or loud noises. Turn your volume down. I'll wait. Okay, wait long enough. I still gotta paint the headliner. It sucks those gauges don't work. Oh, brakes work. I think they work. Having that scoop right there, it's kind of nice. Alright, let's see if it does it again. I don't think it will. Like I said, I think it's that back seat that was doing it. But... Oh, hello. Fourth gear rip. Uh, nope, stalled it. Saved it. Definitely not gonna save this one. It sucks not have my force feedback. I wish they'd fix that. To be honest with you, I really wish they would. Woo wee! Alright. Adrenaline rush is going. Didn't bump it too bad. I definitely smacked it there. But I'm not going to save it. Too much time and effort into this thing. Anytime I drive it, I'm not saving. So, But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button. Just help, help me out as much as you can. Um, I'm not asking to steal your whole bank account. It's just something that's free. So... Uh, 
Thank you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.